My name is Jane. I'm um, in Mac 23. My name is Eleanor, and um, I'm a Mac 24. I'm currently the mechanical co-lead with Jane over there. We are responsible for basically all the mechanical components in the car. Um, that ranges from mainly suspension, steering, roll cage, and pedal assembly. Well, everything that's uh, metal, basically, that's in the car. We designed the suspension and all other components to be able to take um, six times the weight of the car. Basically, take a car across the finish line, you no know, unharmed. And then from then on, we try to optimize for the minimum weight. Weight is directly related to mechanical power, so if it's lighter, the car goes faster. Lots of fighting with the aero team because we want our space and they just wouldn't give much of a space. Now we have finished pretty much all the designs and done the engineering drawings and they are just sent out for our manufacturer to making our parts. But there are still some small um, components left. Hopefully by April we're gonna finish all the mechanical components and start Star implementation to install all the components to the car by May and hopefully we'll have a car that's rolling in June. In just uh, 100 days left now, we'll be taking on the ultimate challenge, racing the solar car across the Australian outback, along with uh, 47 other teams from all over the world. And uh, It'll be such an exciting challenge uh, with so many obstacles to overcome and I just can't wait to tackle every single one of those obstacles. It is my pleasure to introduce you the newest solar car, D7. It meant something different to each person on the team. Boundless, uh, bold, beautiful, uh, beast. Honestly, when I stepped into the solar car shop for the very first time uh, six years ago, I would never have imagined that I would be building not just one, but two solar cars. None of this would have been possible without uh, all of you guys that are here today. When uh, we were feeling completely hopeless and out of options, you guys came uh, to rescue and uh, gave us a boost that we desperately needed to get this project going. No idea is too crazy, too out of this world. And that's what this uh, project really is all about. Tackling a seemingly impossible task and coming up with a solution. With that frame of mind, you can accomplish anything. So we designed our car to be as efficient as possible while abiding by all the restrictions set by the regulations. As a group, we create a bunch of designs. We choose a few to analyze, and then we make the final decision based purely on performance. The design is essentially an airplane wing to which we attach wheel covers as well as driver covers. Oh, my God. 
Time 